In today's video, I'll show you how to plant a summer window box. Purple heart plants are the first thing we'll add. This is an overflowing plant that gets small pink flowers. I think the deep purple foliage gives containers a sophisticated look, and I love the contrast it adds against the other greenery. I'll be adding three of these to each window box. Next, I'll be adding some Lamium, another overflowing plant with great coloring. I'm just going to add two of these. I think varied colors and textures give planters the most intriguing finished look, so I try to choose things that stand out from one another. And I like to have three styles of plants, one that overflows, one that flowers, and one that adds height. Some plants cover multiple categories, like our next flowering plant, Great Punch Superbells. These flower and overflow. I'll add two of these to the planter. For some height in the back, I'll be adding a coffee cups plant next. These are adorable plants, and being named coffee cups makes them even more fun to me. I used these in a planter at my grandma's one summer because of the plant's neat coloring and shape, and also because grandma loves coffee, so that made it an even more perfect choice. The final two plants I will add are some coleus. Coleus is always a showy addition to planters with its interesting coloring. And it comes in many different shapes and colors, so you can choose one that coordinates with almost any color combination. These will add some more height and fullness in the back. I always like to carefully blend the plants into each other a little to make them look like they have been growing next to one another for a while. And here's the finished look. Making custom planters can be a little pricey, so if you want to save a little money this summer, consider making a few simple planters like these, which feature a green velvet boxwood shrub in each of them. Purchasing a variety of individual plants for a container can cost more than a shrub, so making a few shrub containers with a boxwood, rose, hydrangea, or arborvitae can give your planter a full look for less. Another great way to save some money is to purchase hanging baskets to fill planters, like these $11 baskets I purchased at Fleet Farm. I can't wait to watch these grow this summer. Welcome to my channel. I'm Christopher Heidemann and I love to decorate. Over the years, I've had a blast sharing a variety of craft and decorating videos. From cozy fall and spooky Halloween to warm and inviting Christmas. And other fun videos including seasonal home tours, garden tours, simple desserts and treats, floral arrangements, and other projects to make your holidays and home even more spectacular.